Hi everyone, this is Ami Diamond. How are you? From SharePoint Wizard. In this episode, I'd like to show you a new sharing experience for pages in SharePoint. So I'm now on the team site and actually I will uh, look at the home page and I see here share and now I have a drop down. So I can share a page or copy link to a page. Now I have created a new page and you see here under share, I have three possibilities. Share page, copy link to page, and send to by email. So let's check each one of those and what, what they are. So share page actually uh, gives us a possibility <coughs> to share only the specific page. You can um, choose if it's people in, in your tenant, if it's uh, existing people, or you can choose specific people that you choose. Uh, so let's leave the people in the tenant or people with existing. And actually we can put a name of a user, in this case, Alex, and we can send it or we can copy the link and uh, send it by mail. Here we actually, you see who the page is now shared. Second option, as we saw, is to copy the link. Actually, it gives us a possibility to copy. We can also choose here um, the sharing settings, and uh, actually, it gives the link. Third option is to send an email, and here you see actually, we see a preview. I can uh, say, let's send it to Alex. And I could put the message, hello world, and I can just send it and user will get it, even email sent. This is uh, interesting, this uh, notification. So this is in short what I wanted to show you. You can test it and see what you think. Uh, strangely enough, there's a difference between uh, the home page and uh, an additional page. So we see the send to email does not exist on this home page, but that's not really such a big difference. Um, okay, if you like my channel, subscribe and see you in the next episode. Goodbye.